everyone, Amber from The Vault here. Welcome back to more Dishonored Death of the Outsider. Absolutely a fantastic Dishonored game so far. I really like this one. I felt like Death of the Outsider didn't have as much fanfare around it as I would have expected it for, a, you know, a full-ass Dishonored game. I didn't hear about it that much. Maybe I just wasn't looking in the right circles. I just I was hearing about other games. I really didn't hear a lot about this one. And I, I have to be honest, you know, if that's true, if it didn't get a lot of attention, it is way underrated. This has been a fantastic game so far. Then again, I do like the Dishonored series, so maybe it's just somebody, uh, you know, coming from a fan of the series, it probably doesn't mean a whole lot, because of course I'm going to like most of the games. That said, I did not like Mass Effect Andromeda as much as I thought I would, so who knows? There can always be a bad game in each series. We're going to go ahead and jump back into Dishonored. You're not here to hear me discuss the intricacies of game series and which ones I do and don't like and how they could have made them better. That's not here. what we're here for. Uh, we are here to watch me do really stupid things, make a lot of mistakes, and then hopefully get it done right at least the fifth time. So let's go ahead and get back into it. I'll see you back in just a sec. Alright, so we may have made a small error. A miscalculation, if you will. Uh, on some of the things that I just did. So let's go ahead and try to do this a little more quietly this time. What was that? I think he's coming this way. He is. I can grab him, hopefully. I don't know if anyone else heard him. I was trying so hard to stay in the corner. Okay, okay. Let's foresight the fuck out of this. Now we know there's a couple guys in here. Mark. Mark. Oh, we still got that guy. So let's go ahead and get that guy out. I think there's just the four more of them. Not that four more isn't a lot, it is. There we go. Okay, I'm gonna go through and loot the bodies later. I'm trying to concentrate on this right now. Please don't turn around, please don't turn around, please don't turn around. Please don't turn around, please don't turn around, please don't turn around. Please don't turn around. I might be able to get away without using any of my hook mines or anything. Oh, that's beautiful! Okay. It should be all of them. Alright, we should be good. I believe that's all of them. We'll take that. Alright. Whew! I just was so nervous. Okay. Can't loot him. I was hoping maybe he'd have some money. Although I don't know if I need all this money. We're definitely picking up a fair bit in this part of the game. Ooh, bath salts. I wonder if I snort those if I go insane. Yes, that's what I'm wondering with my life right now. They seem to be doing all kinds of crazy ass shit. Like, I mean, not that the... The... Fucking... Girls weren't doing. Cr oh shit! Hello. Not that the witches weren't doing crazy ass shit, but it's like, whoa. I mean, definitely in this game, the overseers have never felt good to me. I don't think they're supposed to. But they definitely have that like weird old Catholic thing. That's what I mean when I say like I think that they might have based them on like Catholicism. I'm not talking modern Catholicism. I mean, I'm talking like old, old-fashioned. And I'm sure there's a good percentage of you that I do not have to explain this to, and you're going to be like, Amber, you don't have to explain that. We know what you mean. But some people I will have to explain this to, because they'll just get mad at me and they'll be yelling at me like, that's not what Catholics do. Well, it is what they did at the turn of the century in shits. So we can't shoot that because it freaks the fuck out. But all that's in there is is the razor trap, spring razor, so I'm not too worried about it. I don't really need those. Um, I checked him, right? Yeah. Grab this. So I'm not really getting much out of this one. Let's go into the lavatory real quick. Sometimes bathrooms are nice because you get those bathing salts. Let's go ahead and actually keyhole peek. 
Oh, shit. Okay. Perfect. So we're back here. I can handle that. All right. Sounds good. All right. So now we might as well just go upstairs again. I think that's where our next option is. We need to go upstairs, finish all the upstairs stuff, and then I think the ladies are actually downstairs. Let's see. Where do we need to go? We need to go to the curator's office. But it sounds like there's women downstairs? But I could be wrong. Maybe the women were upstairs and I just thought I was hearing them downstairs. I mean, they definitely sounded like they were coming from downstairs. Oh, oh shit. Okay, hold on. I think she is just about to see me. Ocular sisters. I don't really know what that means. What does it mean to be an ocular sister? That sounds like an insane cult. Oh. Shit. Huh. Usually you can use those areas to get in, but this one I can't. They are next to each other, so maybe... Nice! Okay. Nice. Got... Dead! How is she dead? Hold on. How is she dead? That counted as a death against me, but I don't know how she died. I clearly used the non-lethal item! Oh, that is annoying. Well, whatever. I can take one more death. That's just really annoying. Oh, man. All right. You know you know the deal. Pausey, pausey. Man, I'm really disappointed that, that that happens. That really sucks. Okay. Well, nothing we can do now. Sister Kue, audiograph entry for the 15th day of the month of rain. Our investigations have led us to these unseemly devices. I have been attending to the dead, and some evenings I've heard voices coming from them. They speak in the manner of our trances. My sisters do not believe me, and some have gone so far as to accuse me of a lying tongue. I know this is black magic, some remnant of the witch's heresy, but I speak the truth. I brought this machine to record their utterances. They should speak any moment. Why am I the only one to hear our dead speak? What temptations of black magic are these? It whispers through their teeth. A voice without a throat. I swear to you that I've heard it. Well, I mean, I know they do too, but it sounds like you're a witch. That was kind of a cute sound. Okay. Sometimes I'm not sure if I'm hearing someone else or if I'm hearing the rats. A little fucked up, rat buddies. A little fucked up. Victim of her own restless hands. She should be burned in the street with the rest of the filth. Why isn't she? It's been three days since she fell. I must send a message to the overseers to kind of clean this up. Okay. So give me a second. Sorry about the pause there, guys. All right, let's go ahead and... Foresight. I can hear a woman. There's another one, though, isn't there? She sounds like she's talking to someone. Oh, yes, she is down there. I can't even imagine if I was trying to do this without powers. Oh my god. What's that? Sister Rosalind, Rosalind, I think, keeps a detailed record of her prophetic visions. Rumor has it she knows every secret. 
Da 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 da! I'm give all my bone charms to whoever managed the conservatory. Okay. All right. <sighs> Shit. She's turned away. Okay. Let's grab her must... really quick. Come on! Come on! Come on! Come on! Come on! Here. There we go. Their eyes are like shut off. Like that is so creepy. Okay, so we know there's the one there. I know there's at least one down here. I know we're so far away from our physical form. I know, I know, I know. But I'm just like, I wanna know. Okay. Chances are she's not going to see me, but... <sighs> Gosh, like, the tension is so good in this game. She must come down there at some point. I come back down the hall. So I can grab her then. Let's wait a little bit. Okay, here we go. Oh, she's only going that far? Oh, no, no, there she goes, okay. How can they see me with those bandages around their necks? I mean, how does that work? Can I loot her? Nope, okay. There's the other one still. Got this. All right. Should be careful here. Oh, there's an overseer in there. Okay, hold on. There's an overseer in here. I was not planning on being here. Um, overseer. Okay. Any other men or women? Ah, oh, okay, I know where this is. Lies come back as the voice of the outsider. He might hear me here. Nope, okay. Disgraceful. So disgraceful. Can you believe it? It's just disgraceful. Nice, there we go, there we go. Okay. Oh, so there's still one more person. It's funny because I started this out. Globe! I started this out and I was like, okay, this can't be that bad. Like, this is actually going really well so far. These guys are pretty easy to pick off. And then I got in here and now I'm like, oh my god. <laughs> I'm slowly dying. Then I started just fucking everything up. Alright, so we are almost to the curator's area. So I know where we are now. We are very close to the same spot where we got stuck earlier. Where we could hear that guy talking, but we didn't know where he was. That's where we are now. So I can't go through that door. So I can't use that to get me anywhere. If I can follow her down this hallway, that'll work real well. I just gotta be able to grab her before she notices me. Sister Rosewin seems agitated today. I believe a recent vision presses upon her. She and a few of our sisters are on the terrace now. I must join them. Okay, before you do that, let me figure out where the hell you are. Okay. One there. There's one there. So here in Delilah's office. Which makes sense. I mean, they should be in Delilah's office, you'd think. I understand if she is ill at ease. I am disturbed by the archive we've uncovered here. Oh, on the task at hand, sister. 
Ours is important work. We all bear the burden of the Abbey's future. Oh shit, that's gonna make noise, isn't it? Okay, once they stop talking, usually they separate more. My thought was maybe to just grab this girl's face. And then I would be able to go up there and attack the next girl. A little bit easier. I guess I could just knock her out too. Okay, she didn't seem to notice. We seem good so far, we seem good so far. Okay. Ooh, slowly but surely getting through this. Slowly but surely. Now this is weird. What's going on here? They scream into the difference and whisper questions. All their hate, their loneliness, terror. They, they break its loss. All right. Well, let's do this real quick. Let's foresight up here so we can see. So we got this one here. Okay, Cardoza's up here. At least I think that's what he's, his name is. Okay, we got some there. So I think maybe we could pull her off separately we might be able to i'm not sure brother cardoza sister rosewin requests your presence on the terrace it's about the heretic archive she wants you to take it yes yes very good tell sister rosewin i'll be right there i need to finish one of the peasants before this creature's flesh degrades further hmm Curve. there we go there we go I'm actually going to grab him and bring him downstairs real quick. I need him for that side mission, so I'm going to go ahead and just bring him down to here so that I can have him, so I don't have to worry about chasing him down later on. Let's bring him to just a safe spot. Oh god, that bus scared me for a second. I thought it was a fucking person. Oh my god, I panicked for a second there. Um, you know what, let's just put him right here for now. We need him later. Okay, leave him there. Let's go ahead and run back up. Alright. So I know there's a bone charm near, but I need to handle these ladies before I can deal with any bone charms. I know there's quite a few of them out there, so let's go ahead and just foresight all of them. Mark. Mark. Oh, I think there's way too many of them. There's way too many of them. Wow. Wow, 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 wow. Okay. I don't think there's anything I can do here except for maybe to put out a few of these. Something isn't right. Have you found something? Let's see what happens. Okay, let's see what happens. I don't know if I got any of them out. in this place this! shit they did notice me oh my soon enough keep searching sisters god flesh degrades further all right here we go curvature is eroded in the frontal lobe so this was pretty easy we can do this one again Let's go ahead and grab him. Um, I don't know what we're going to do about the witches on on the uh, deck there. I don't know what to do with them. That seems like a really difficult one. I just don't know. I'm going to go ahead and run.
If I do alert them, I'm not too concerned. It's not like they're gonna find me here. So I don't know how to how to get them. My first thought was that maybe I could like I don't know. My first thought was maybe I could just be able to, you know, like I don't know, hit multiples of them at once. But that does not seem to be working. So I'm gonna do a little bit of thinking. I'm not sure I know what to do in this case. Hmm. I am gonna go ahead and drop him here though. I just don't know what to do with them. I don't know, because it would make sense to me that we would maybe use those those grenades because they're helpful, but if I didn't get any of them out, then that doesn't help. You know what I mean? I'm gonna go ahead and save pretty soon here, but you know what, let's go ahead and actually look for that bone charm. We might as well. Let's see, where is this bone charm? I assume it's up. Uh, mission notes, crap bone charm. That's probably it. Okay, where actually is that? Okay, that's directly above us. I think it's in the room that we just left him in. I think I can run up here, but I have to be quiet around here. Okay. I just don't know what to do with them, because I feel like... How am I going to pick them off one by one, you know? That seems like a really tall order. Like, not to be... Not to be awkward, but <laughs> it seems like a tall order. Okay. Is that something I can read? Oh, yeah, here we go. All right. Da-da-da-da-da. Okay. Good enough, good enough. Okay. Let's look around real quick. The subject of today's examination is a well-developed, well-nourished woman appearing the offered age of 29 years. Cause of death is undetermined. Brother Wells saw her collapse during musical therapy, convulsing and screaming. Which heretical organ inside her wasted, pale flesh rejected the ancient music? Initial examination showed no rigor, and lividity was at a minimum and unfixed. The unembalmed body is well preserved and cool to the touch. Pressure on the chest reveals pliant skin. No contusions, no marks. Only smooth. Flawless. Why must it take death to purify the darkness from your flesh? How can I remove the stain of heresy from your body and preserve this wondrous symmetry of form? How to cut out the outsider's foul influence from inside you, leaving only grace and perfected beauty behind? Oh yes, my dear. You are lovely like this. Lovely. Oh my god, creep! That's insane! I mean, that man just... That was odd, okay? That was weird. Oh shit, there's women over there too? Oh, motherfucker, you gotta be kidding me. Okay. Let's do this real quick. I think she might be alone, which is good news. Yeah, it appears she is alone, so at least I could maybe get her out. I still want to know how they're seeing me with their eyes covered. Okay. One thing I could do is I could use semblance to get close to her. Hmm. Why does that keep happening? That's kind of odd, isn't it? Here we go. Okay. Oh, I don't know what to do. I don't know what to do. I don't know what to do. I just don't know what to do. Okay, what am I supposed to do to her? Just knock her out? Okay, just acquire the archive. I wonder if I just listen. Some calamity approaches. Lena has seen it. Okay. 
I was hoping maybe they would just talk. Doesn't look like they're gonna do that. Like sometimes they'll talk and separate, you know? All right, let's go ahead and try this again. But Oracle will not return to us before the month of songs. But there's still so much to prepare. Like maybe we can knock out Lena this time. They don't seem affected by it. Wow, they don't seem that affected by it. Oh. Are they not affected by hook mines? Okay, no, they must be. But I'm not a witch. Oh my gosh. That was really bad. I just want to point out that I'm embarrassed at how bad that was. Um, let's move her body. Did she actually... She didn't get knocked out by a hook mine. Wow, I am embarrassed by what just happened. I performed so badly. Oh, wow. Just throw that bitch. I don't really care. Um, give me that hook mine. Now I have one. Oh, my gosh. That was really sad. So she's still up there. So I did knock some of them out, but that was done really poorly. I'm embarrassed at how badly I did that. Wow. Well, I'll pick those up. <laughs> I think that's what I was supposed to use anyway. All right, so now I need to go get the silver graph. Silver graph. Silver graph projector. Wow, I did a really bad job on that one. I can take oh, a wow. look at this with a silver graph projector. If the oracular order really can see the future, then this silver graph plate will tell me what I need to know. Okay. Jesus. All right, ladies and gentlemen. So I'm going to go ahead and drop in the part where I go and check out the... Uh, wait, what did I see? Oh, Chlorophyll Ball. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and drop in the part where I go ahead and check out the silver plate. I, there's no commentary on that one because I was actually trying to also figure out how to get a very specific uh, contract completed. I went ahead and completed it. It is this one, Alvaro and the Abbey. I wanted to go ahead and do that. I have to kill everyone on the level in order to do that. So I had to go back through and go every single place I've been in this entire level and kill everyone. So I went, I'm going to go ahead and drop that in. That's going to look a little weird. Uh, just wanted to let you know what's going on, and then I'll go ahead and meet you back up when we kind of meet back up with the story. But I wanted to go ahead and let you know what I'm about to do. So I'm about to go ahead and drop that in. It'll show you what happened when I picked up that silver plate and when I took it off. Uh, or I, I went ahead and watched it. Sorry, I can't even speak English. So I'm going to go ahead and go to the end of the game now. So you'll see me back after that in just a second. There shouldn't be anything on this part of the mountain. Shindere North Quarry. That's where the Eyeless are getting into the void. I should keep the silver graph plate with me. All right, ladies and gentlemen, we're going to go ahead and finish here. We need to head up to Billy's outpost in order to get out of here. So I think we can handle this. Let's go ahead and jump up here. Ooh, I was hoping that would get us a little bit closer so that maybe we could get all the way up there. I guess not. That's okay. We can go ahead and go up here. I can't actually tell where that was taking me, but whatever. It worked out. Let's see. Can I jump there? No, I can't. Okay. There we go. This should get me up to Billy's outpost. Okay. So let's go ahead and pick up anything that's in here we might need. I think there's some electric bolts in here. I did go ahead and steal everything from the, um, oh gosh, the black market dealer. I went ahead and stole everything from the black market dealer. So we need to go flee into the mountains is our next one. I can't even believe that. This is so crazy. I thought that there were some electric bolts in here. Am I crazy? Was there no electric bolts in here and I just made this up in my head? 
I could have sworn there was electric bolts in here. Maybe there's some downstairs. Shit. Well, I don't know if there's going to be a black market dealer in the next area. That's my concern. That said, I'm pretty well stocked. The only thing I don't have is, is his incendiary ammo and stuff. So let's just do it. Let's just go for it. Might as well. All right. So I killed a lot of people on that one because, again, my goal on that one was not to be stealthy. I ended up having to, in order to get, um, let me go ahead and actually go forward. In order to get the contract for Alvaro in the Abbey, I had to kill everyone that was in the Abbey. Um, and I wanted to go ahead and do that. Oop, I didn't mean to do that. I wanted to go ahead and do that. So I went ahead and did it. I killed everyone in there. Not that I'm really, um, not that I'm proud of myself for killing that many people. Um, it does change the way I feel, though, a little bit about the game. Uh, I just, I don't know, I feel weird that the... I feel weird that in this one, chaos doesn't matter, and I didn't realize that this whole time I've been playing as if chaos mattered, and it turns out it doesn't. So, here we go. We're going to go ahead and head to the quarry. I'll see you back in just a sec. All right, thank you so much for watching me play Dishonored Death of the Outsider. If you like this video, please remember to like, comment, and subscribe. It does mean a lot to me. It really is a huge motivation to keep moving forward. And of course, it helps other people find the video so that we can grow the channel. And hopefully, maybe someday we could get some even cooler, even better games up here on the channel. If you want to talk to me outside of YouTube, check me out on Twitter, at Amber from the Vault, spelt the same way as here. No O in from, no E in the. Until then, if you want to see more Dishonored Death of the Outsider, there will be a playlist on your screen in just a second. There'll also be a video that YouTube thinks you'd like based on your viewing history, as well as a picture of my big dumb face you can click on to subscribe to the channel. I'm going to go ahead and get out of here, but I'll see you all in the next one.